Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. Assalamu alaikum everyone. So today you have seen Sir Javed Aziz standing with the two little girls. So Taiba Aziz Malik, my niece, elder one, she is in uh, grade 3. And uh, Alishba Aziz Malik, the younger naughty one, she is in playgroup. So actually today I decided that uh, because I have promised to many of my teachers that uh, we will work on phonetic sounds, phonics. Actually, this phonics topic is very important. So when I was preparing phonics so that I can uh, compile the video, they both, these both girls, they were sitting with me. So they said, sir, please, they call me sir at home. So they said, sir, please, we will take the names and you will go with sounds. So actually, what names and sounds are? Actually, there are 26 alphabets, A to Z. And when we say A, B, C, D, these are names of alphabets. And when we say A, B, so these are sounds. So they said we will go with uh, names and uh, you will pronounce the sounds. Actually, you know, this is a very serious topic. So after the names, they will uh, quit and uh, then I will start with the phonics sounds. Remember that phonics sound is the relationship. In spoken English, it is the relationship of letters, group of letters and syllables. So we have to work very seriously. So today this topic will help all the Montessori teachers how to teach phonics plus parents, mothers at home. Because mothers, they are very disturbed sometimes that how we can te teach phonics. So what they can do is, they watch this video and with the help of this video, they can teach themselves, their own children, what phonic sounds are. So we will start with the names. So first of all, Taiba, uh, what are the basic names of 26 alphabets? Please start. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T. U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay, now I'll for you. Come on. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, P, W, X, Y, N, G. Yes! Yes! Dear students and teachers, now you will listen the phonic sounds very carefully and after that I will tell you how we can use it in classroom and other how you can improve your phonetic phonic sound remember that phonics the other name for phonics sound is alphabetic principle so we are learning alphabetic principle today we will start from A then sound will be coming to you so you have to listen very carefully actually the sounds so remember that uh, once i'm going to start from a to z and you will listen the sound very carefully and practice with this you have to listen carefully this is the very first thing the important one
So, dear students, you have heard the sounds. Now, I must tell you one thing. That uh, teachers, when you apply, I told you in beginning that we don't need to copy the phonic sounds of Americans and Britishers. We are in Pakistan. We are teachers. We are leaders. So we will produ produce our own sounds. So remember, the sound when you produce, I am telling you the words. Now you have heard the phonic sound. How you can make it more clear? Look at this list. When you pronounce A, the start of apple. When you say apple, a, apple, a, b, bird, b, bird. So go through this list and practice your phonic sound according to it. A as in apple, B as in bird, C as in curl, D as in dirt, E as in egg, F as in firm, G as in girl, H as in her, I as in ink, J as in jerk, K as in curb, L as in learn, M as in mug, N as in nurse, O as in ox, P as in purse, Q as in quick, R as in run, S as in six, T as in turn, U as in up, V as in worse, W as in world, X as in box, Y as in ear, Z as in zebra. Remember, if you will follow this list and according to list, prepare your own phonetic sounds, then you will be very successful. So work on this and inshallah, very soon you'll be uh, working on this. The next few videos on phonics, I will tell you how to join the words. How to join the words with the help of with the help of phonics and this alphabetic principle. So wait for next few videos. Dear teachers and especially mothers, you have heard the sound. I have told you this thing before, I will repeat again. Remember, we are not going to copy Americans or Britishers. This is our need. This is need of our children. So you have to create your own sound according to your plans. I have given you the instruction about these. ABC, how you pronounce? When you say ah, you say apple, ah, bird, b, b, b as in bird. When you say curl, c as in curl. So you say k. So I have told you all these. Tell Z. So produce your own side according to these words. According to these words. When you say zebra, then what is when you say zebra, then z, z sound starts from here. So create your sound. If you will take help from this, then your phonic sound will be perfect. And your child will learn it very easily. So try this thing. Now after this, in next for next video, what I am going to do is I will tell you how a child will make herself or himself the reading of the word with the help of phonics. So please wait for second video and please I want your comments on this. This is very important because if you want me to change, then I will change it for you. There are many ways to teach phonics. So if you don't like my this style, then I will bring another style for you. So I will wait for your comments. Please don't. Every time write very good mashallah and this. If you want to criticize, I will love to hear it from you. Because in this way, we can improve. So your family channel is actually your channel. Subscribe the channel and write comments and press the bell icon. So that as soon as I will get your comment, I will reply to you. And if you want to change me, I will change it for you. There are thousands of methods to teach phonetics. So once again, thank you for your time and uh, love you all. Bye. Allah Hafiz.